So here's a crepe myrtle that I take my cuttings from. It's fairly tiny, uh, but it's white. It has white flowers on it. And I really like it. So I just come down here and I take a sucker or two off. Well, I just take a sucker at a time off. And then I uh, put in some sand to root it. I'll do that this evening uh, just because it's going to be so hot today. I don't want those suckers to be too stressed out when I try to root them. Okay, so I've cut them all. So this is what they look like. We've got about four to six nodes on them. The smaller ones have six. And so now what I'm gonna do is tear off all the leaves except for the very top leaf. Okay, and I'll show that to you in just a sec. Okay, so I pulled all the leaves off and this is what they look like right now. So I'm just going to take all of these and I'm going to stick them in sand right down here. So that's about it. I do about a row a week in sand. <coughs> And then I will just uh, sprinkle some water on them and let them be. It's been really hot. It's been, it was 108 yesterday. So if they didn't take root, they're not going to make it just because it was so hot. The little ones seem to do a lot better. The taller ones don't seem to do as well. Um, but I keep doing this every two to five days. I do, so I... The next three weeks, the rest of that will be full. And we'll see how it turns out. All right, today is July 13th, and these are the crepe myrtles that I rooted. Uh, today is only just above 100, I believe, so it's cooler. So I'm gonna take these out and repot them so I don't have to worry about watering them. So it's been, like I said, super hot here, 108, 106. Uh, for 20 days already going on 30 so I am I was not able to water them every day and that hurt so next time I'm gonna wait till it gets out of the hundreds every day and I'm gonna do this again but I'm gonna put a humidity dome over everything and see how that works so as you can see I have one two three four that made it so i'm gonna pull those out i'll pot them up and if i see any roots on the bottom of anything i'll uh do those as well so here we go
So here is a four out of 60 I rooted. Four of them look like they're gonna make it. The rest are all fried or dead. I'll go ahead and post this and then I'll make another one when it gets below 100 degrees and uh, we will try again. And this time I'll try with the humidity dome and see if that doesn't help. All right, so that was my first attempt at rooting crepe myrtles. Didn't go too hot, so see you on the next one and uh, hopefully it'll go a lot better. All right, thanks for watching, bye.